universities. Oh, universities of applied sciences. No, 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 no. College of Film, Music, and Arts. Hello everyone, welcome to another video, hope you are doing well, my name is George Ms. Costa and I'm actually running a channel that is called George Ms. Costa. So hope all you are doing well and welcome to my channel. So what will be today's topic? Uh, that would be uh, an, a rudimentary thing, actually an important thing and a kind of basic thing. like. Uh, with what kind of uh, universities are available in Germany and when you are going to select your university uh, what type of features should be in your mind in your choosing category because different kinds of universities are there in Germany and those contains different kinds of features so I will just describe the features and I will suggest something so for getting the solution please 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 watch till the end so there are basically two kinds of university if uh, i can explain it in a general purpose and that uh, and these are number one is public university number two would be private university so there are uh, mostly uh, 300 plus public universities that actually are uh, running by the government and uh, on the other hand there are 120 plus private universities that are running from the private um, private funds so what is the basic difference uh, between private and public university for me it would be uh, public university most public universities there is a state that is outside of my concern from uh, my from from my my section or from my mind and um, uh, apart from that most of the universities uh, public universities are free that means the educations are free there uh, on the other hand um, the private universities are not that free and that they actually uh, demand uh, pretty much high cost for your education so these two type of universities are there so for me, I would suggest please do choice public universities because it is pretty much not that much complex for you if you are trying to get inside or get admitted inside a German university like a German public university. So now I have suggested that please do choose uh, the pub public universities. Now there are three kinds of public universities. Number one is universities. Number two would be universities of applied sciences and number three would be college of art, film and music. So what is university basically? Basically universities um, is uh, the basic um, university what the general universities like uh, you know, like in Bangladesh if I can uh, explain you the, uh, the, the scenario that would be like Dhaka University, Rashi University, uh, then uh, Bangladesh University of Engineering Technology, Kulna University of Engineering Technology. These are the basic universities and these basic universities belongs to like university section because in university section there are um, there can be technical universities like TUM like general universities like um, Heidelberg University and uh, number three would be different types of medical colleges and different types of college of educations so specifically university is the category where uh, the researches are going to be applied very much that means that would be very academic the degrees would be uh, academic uh, oriented and um, pretty much in uh, involved in research section section so if you are trying or thinking about your PhD after your MSc then you should target this university section like technical universities or different of medical schools or college of educations on the other hand if I can describe University of Applied Sciences University of Applied Sciences are basically um, you know 
involved in the practical section or practical oriented education most of the uh, education systems are in um, in internship approach or different types of industrialized things are covered in this um, uh, universities of applied sciences so if you are thinking about university of applied sciences do think one thing that is if you pursuing your masters from university of applied sciences there would be a lesser opportunity for pursuing your uh, phd after your masters because the curriculum or course are very much industrially designed and they are not capable of or uh, pretty much not granted for your uh, phd after your masters so for university of applied science there is less opportunity i would say 99.9 percent .9 opportunities are there not to having any kinds of phd after your masters it means if you are pursuing your masters from university of applied science then you have to join your job like after msc go to job but for university like technical universities you have a opportunity or an opportunity of having phd after your masters or if you want you also can join job okay so there are lots of um, um, uh, university of applied sciences like top university of applied sciences like you need uh, um, in uh, munich university of applied sciences then rhino university of applied sciences there are pretty much um, many universities that are applied their sciences so keep eye on them okay then last thing would be uh, college of arts music and film so the viewers or students who are from arts background and trying to involve uh, for their masters after their graduation in germany uh, from the background of different kinds of extracurricular activities like music, film, acting, fashion and designing, uh, then contemporary dance. So these kinds of passionate extracurricular activities or uh, passionate potentials or potency of anyone can be enriched in Germany because they have actually other kinds of universities that are specifically involved in these kinds of scenarios. So there are uh, some university names, I have actually listed some of them. Uh, one is Kostgat University of Contemporary Dance in Berlin. And another one is Contemporary School of Arts Hamburg. So these two universities are pretty much popular in Germany for their uh, um, dance and arts type of subjects. So these three kinds of uh, universities are available. Number one would be universities, pure universities. These are research oriented. Number two would be University of Applied Sciences that are pretty much in practical approach and industrial approach. Number three would be College of Film, Arts and Music. Now I would actually describe two things, universities and universities of Applied Sciences very well because uh, I actually knew a uh, better uh, differences uh, among them between them actually so number one universities are pretty much research oriented universities of applied science are not pretty much research oriented rather they are actually indicating the industrial thing universities like technical universities you can do your MSc then go for your PhD or then go for your uh, masters for universities of applied science you cannot do your phd most of the case after after your masters okay technical universities and university mostly um, cover 120 cts that means 90 credits from a bangladeshi point of view or bangladesh point of view and on the other hand university of applied sciences contain mostly 90 cts that means most probably 60 credit um, um, 60 credit on uh, inside their uh, course curriculum technical university of uh, technical universities are 
actually um, covering your courses within two year semester on the other hand um, University of Applied Sciences are offering you three semesters that means 1.5 years of the course so these are the basic difference between universities that means technical universities and universities of applied science now from my point of view my point of view would be do choose your passion like if you want to pursue your PhD like if you have any doubt on that please clear on the, uh, clear your vision and if you do not want your PhD like I don't want to go for PhD anytime in my life then go for technical university of or University of Applied Science but if you have a little concern or little bit of wish to pursue pursuing your PhD after your graduation or after your MSc then please please do choose technical universities that means pure universities like technical university of Munich, technical university of Berlin, uh, Heidelberg University, LMU so these are the universities are pretty much uh, will cover the whole thing if you want to pursue pursuing your phd look at the, look look at the whole scenario if you are pursuing your masters from technical universities or pure university like Heidelberg university you do have two choices right after your masters number one would be phd and one, another would be uh, job so you have two options there but if you are thinking about University of Applied Sciences then there is just one option and that would be your job so uh, from my from my opinion I would suggest please please follow your passion and and from my recommendation I would suggest do choose Pure universities or new technical universities because they contain the uh, higher opportunities like from universities of applied sciences but both kinds of universities are pretty 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 good and brilliant from their side from their point of view from their education system so these are the criteria and features that you will find when you are um, going to choose your university section or what kind of university because there are lots of confusion because there are three kinds of universities and when I was in your position I was pretty much confused about what to choose like technical universities or universities of applied science I, I, I didn't even know that there are basic differences between these two kinds of universities and like after my application procedure when I have admitted at TUM after that I actually found that if you are going to pursue your MSc from University of Applied Science there will be like no opportunities for your PhD so these kinds of uh, informations are pretty much not known to all so like like a country like Bangladesh it's pretty much uh, not known to everyone to every students uh, so I think this information will pretty much helpful for you and if you do have any doubt you can comment here below and if you are not like uh, subscribing then please do subscribe because I am doing my best so you have to just click a button but I have to do many other things so just click a button and click the bell icon do like do subscribe and comment below I will be um, uh, leaving all video links in the description section and also the that filter website link so that is all from today's video hope you will like it and if you don't don't but if you like it please 
subscribe and share with other friends that uh, will be pretty much helpful for me because I want each and every one who are trying for their higher education inside Germany they can know the better things they can know the higher number of things and informations are pretty much easy nowadays and I am just spreading this information so thank you very much uh, for today's video hope you will like it and please do subscribe and be safe because Corona is everywhere everywhere and stay home Stay cool, stay calm and just do your preparation and focus on your study. Thank you so much.